Yo, what's doing, everybody? If you guys clicked on this video, I'm guessing y'all are struggling to shoot a little bit on 2K23. Or maybe you just got bored your jump shot and you want another one. But hey, you came to the right place regardless. As you're gonna see by these intro clips, I really just don't be missing in this park. I kind of figured out the shooting. So let's just get right into this. First things first, you don't want to go to your controller settings. We need to fix a few things. I personally prefer to have vibration off, trigger effect off, because I don't like my controller vibrating going crazy like that. Take that shot meter off, except I have it on free throws only, because who knows how the time they free throws, let's be honest, okay? And then shot timing, release time. I use early. I don't know if this is the best one. Some people use late. I prefer to use early. I don't know. If you want to shoot like me, put that shit on early. Next thing we're gonna go over is the badges. My build gets 20 shooting badges and I do not have a core badge. So this is what I am rocking right now. Now, honestly, limitless range never even pops up. Look at my core progression and I shoot from half core all the time. Let me just show y'all an example. Look at where I be shooting from. Look at, I shoot from half court all the time. I know the clip got cut short, but if you keep looking in the top right, limitless range never pops up when you shoot from this deep. And my core progression badge, whatever you want to call it, has barely ever moved. So honestly, you could take off limitless range if you don't think, feel like you need it. If you don't shoot from deep, put on some dead eye or some blinders. But the rest of these badges, I do recommend using. Come back kid on bronze, do be coming in clutch sometimes. How do I tell you? For now, I'm going to keep it on because I don't like to switch my badges, but let's go over takeovers. Now, if you do not know, takeovers boost your tendencies for that category, whether or not it's activated. So this limitless range primary badge is going to help me shoot from deeper, whether or not it's activated. If you are struggling in the part to shoot, then double up on the sharp takeover because like I said, whether or not takeover is activated, it boosts your tendencies in that category. So spotted position is going to help you shoot staying still shots and if you're really struggling to shoot go buy some jump shot boots okay me personally i don't really like to use these because it kind of throws off my time and i just like to shoot without boost plus i ain't gonna lie i was using way too much vc buying them things week one but anywho let's finally go over this jump shot okay so obviously you're gonna want to go to my animations the jump shot creator and don't worry about all these jump shots i have okay it took me a little bit to find the right one but i did so here's my jump shot right here base lamello ball release one and release two are both austin robinson as y'all see it has an a plus in everything besides timing impact a lot of people say that shit matters but honestly i mean y'all see how i shoot that I don't know bro, I don't really think it matters that much, it has an A plus in everything else. And also, a lot of builds are able to use this jump shot. As you see, the requirements are not hard to meet. All you have to do is be below 6'10 and have an 85 three-pointer or mid-range, which I feel like a lot of people have this year. So yeah, that is the jump shot, and don't worry, I got y'all with the gameplay I know y'all did not want. I skipped the first three possessions because I took nothing but dunce, but oh my god, look at the first shot, I do a step back in green. Now right here I hit him with a little spin and roo step back. I don't know why I didn't pull that bitch. I missed the over dribble sometimes, so I went in for the dunk. I don't even know why I put that in there. I'm so sorry. Now if you looked at the bottom right and the top right, you notice that my team has eight points and I got all of them. But I didn't even take no three, so I was like, eight. Hey, let me just pull this shit from half court real quick and shoot a green. Nah 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 nah, you feel me? Like I said before, this is a jump shot video. I don't know why I was taking so many twos, so many dunks, but look at how I done cooked this man. I was tricking my own teammate. Hey. Maybe I should've just made this a dungeon tutorial, like, let's get back to the jump shots. As you see right here, I'm in the simple little heady stop move, step back, key, try to contest it, but it don't matter. Na 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 na. I'm telling you, this jump shot can do it all to the speed, it got the height. Now right here, River said, let me see this bar. I said, fuck no, baby. She said, hold this green. I said, okay. And I just do a little spin a roo to the stop, to the green. <laughs> It's too easy. So now y'all got the settings, the badges, the jump shot, the take over the everything you need to shoot in this game like me the only shot i miss i don't even know i think i shot the blade i have core must have been lagging we don't even talk about it because i don't even miss okay you see i had all the points on the board if you want to shoot like this just follow everything i said previously in the video if you made it this far in the video i do appreciate you comment down below banana soup if you made it this far don't ask no questions okay also comment down below if this jump shot did help you if you do end up putting on i want to know make sure you leave a like on this video if it did help you out subscribe to the channel if y'all new turn on post notifications so you never miss out on the daily streams or uploads that i got coming okay but yeah i got nothing else to say to y'all i hope y'all have a great rest of your day evening night whenever you are watching this and yeah until next time, I'm going to catch y'all later. Bye.